Have you ever wondered what it would be like to take a journey to the moon? On January 31st, 1971, the Apollo 14 mission launched, marking an important chapter in human space exploration. The Apollo 14 crew consisted of Commander Alan Shepard, Command Module Pilot Stuart Rusa, and Lunar Module Pilot Edgar Mitchell. This mission was crucial as it was the first to land on the Lunar Highlands, known as the Fra Mauro Formation. After the near disaster of Apollo 13, the team had prepared for 19 months, working tirelessly to ensure their success and the future of the Apollo program. As they launched, Shepard, Rusa, and Mitchell faced a critical moment. Just over two days into their journey, technical malfunctions threatened to abort the mission. These challenges tested their courage and skill, and they worked closely with Mission Control to resolve the issues and stay on course. On February 5th, Shepard and Mitchell finally landed on the moon. Upon stepping onto the surface, Shepard famously declared, and it's been a long way, but we're here. Over their two moonwalks, they collected 94.35 pounds of lunar rocks and set up scientific experiments that would gather valuable data. But the mission was more than just rock collecting. Shepard also brought along a golf club and two golf balls, and during one of the moonwalks, he took some memorable swings. This playful moment captured the imaginations of people back on Earth, showcasing the human spirit, even in the vastness of space. Upon returning to Earth, the crew splashed down safely in the Pacific Ocean on February 9, 1971. They were not only heroes of exploration, but also symbols of human resilience and curiosity, having navigated challenges that could have halted the Apollo program for good.